Hey, Haley. What are you doing? I'm just uh, doing some research on recent cases of point shaving and gambling convictions and baby strollers. <laughs> what are you doing right now? Oh, you know, just trying to keep myself busy to avoid hurting myself or the ones I love with an abusive prescription drug addiction. You know, my biggest problems used to be my sarcasm and my hair. <laughs> my addiction was shoes. You know, there's still no rehab program for that. Oh, no. <laughs> so listen, you know, Haley, I think I may have something that can help you. Does it come in a bottle? Sorry, obviously I still have a problem with sarcasm. <laughs> what is it? It is this. Oh, <laughs> you know, the last time I saw that gun, you were um, shooting up Karen's Cafe, so I think I'm going to go. That's not the only thing I was shooting up. I'm kidding. The fact is, Mama's got an addictive nature. So, this is how I get my kicks now. I go to the shooting range. It's a total rush, Haley. You should come with me sometime. You want to try it? Oh, no, thanks. Oh, it's, it's not loaded. Neither am I. <laughs> um, actually, if you could lower your weapon and stop being so weird, I, I had a question I wanted to oh, ask you. Yeah, sorry. It's okay. Um, what? what? What is it? Um, uh, when Nan lost basketball, what happened to him? I mean, did he change or... He was always an ass, right? Oh, um... No, not always. But, um, I don't know, something happens to a person when they lose their dreams. Especially at such a young age. Dan became bitter, and he took it out on everyone around him. Most of the time, on his son. I guess he saw a chance to fulfill his dreams through Nathan. No matter what Nathan wanted.